Right, I've had a few people following my video tutorial about me building my PC uh, asking me about my own BIOS because it's, well, it's cool looking essentially. So I decided to record this little video. Um, let's have a quick look. You've got your options here power saving, and you've got normal, and obviously up to all. And you've got your boot options down here. That's my rated hard drive. That's obviously my optical disk. And that's a thing. Oh, that's the external hard drive that I have plugged in. Uh, and you've got various information here. You've got CPU temperature, level temperature, various voltages, and you've got CPU events, fan speed. You've got the basic information about my board and my computer up here. 8 gigs. There's our processor, motherboard mic and at various speeds and if you go into advanced you can go into advanced mode which looks a wee bit more like the traditional BIOS but you've got a lot more information too basically um, various tweaks there um, overclocking Oops. Well, you've got your power management, your RAM, various details here. Left it all on auto. And you've got CPU configuration. If you want to tweak, you can do endlessly. And there's the monitor. Uh, little temperature is pretty cool. CPU temperature is warm, but not necessarily hot. Uh, I have got more fans installed, but they'll do it in the power supply. Um, got your boot options. It's all fairly simple. Um, and you've got your few overclocking tools there as well. Um, it's all very uh, uninteresting, I guess, but if you're interested in this sort of thing. Uh, and what is uh, just save changes and reset and there's one more thing I will show you uh, this is the following I'll show you it's a fairly standard RAID setup but this is my RAID I've got two terabyte drives RAIDed to stripe zero about one 1.8 terabyte uh, big drive um, it's probably way more space than I need, but I think I'd rather have more than not enough. And I have a USB one to back up. So, there you go. I hope you enjoyed that, and it was informative, and I really have been busy.